Hello everyone, this is Mark. In today's video, I'm going to show you the chilling fiber wider setup process. In the step one, we will go through the connections. Connection the air source, also the set up the, the pressure, also the one feeder installment and the trailer. This is the gas valve and this is the input hole with diameter 6 mm. I will put input the air hose. Yes. Check it. It's tight enough. The other side, the gas hose I connect to the the tank <coughs> with this valve. Adjust um, <coughs> the the gas pressure between zero point eight to one ampere. Now it's the part 8 ampere. From the motion side, the gas valve I adjust the pressure between the 0 0.2 to 0 point, 0 point 0.4, like this. Now it's um, 0 0.3, it's good enough. This is the T21 feeder. Let me introduce the panel. This is the display of the speed and the plus button for faster and the minus button for lower the speed and this is the set button and this is the wrong button manual feeding and the manual retract and this button is for the uh, debug this box was the accessory box for the one feeder. We have four one feeding pulley and uh, two wine connector. And we got two soft one slit or one one guide. We insert the wires into the soft pipe. Also, we got a motion handle. Now, I will use this size soft one guide and uh, a coding connector and um, pulley.
in normal case, we have this put it, put it installed inside the machine, and this is for the backup for different size. Inside the wine feeder, we got a roller and this uh, wine feeding mechanical controller. Both two are the pressure controller for one millimeter width <coughs> wine we use the pressure between one and two and we get the play play installed Release screws. I can move the pulley out. You can see the mark is the one point zero. That's for the one millimeter width wine, and we got a checkpoint on the upside, and we install. The pulley, the <clears throat> the size, the correct size of the, the wine inside, and push it. Rotate and push it in. Okay, and now. The pulley was installed correctly. To the screws, fasten it. Okay, and lock the pulley by. Push it down and lock by the, <coughs> the pressure controller, and that's all good. Next step, I will install a one millimeter width wine for stainless steel and make sure the tightness of the pressure between one and the two. The zone of wine is very heavy, about uh, 20 kilo of one zone. Wines need to be go through the mechanical at a tangent angle to make sure the wines move. Smoothly. Mm. 
Now we got one output. We need to use the wine connector to connect one guide. And now we need to double check the wine just following the proof of the pulley. We can see the wine just falling in the groove of the, the pulley, so that's correct. I will lock it by the um, pressure controller. Fasten this screw heavily to avoid the connector which push out when the wire one the working. I release the pressure controller and recheck if the wine was inside the groove of the pulley correctly and now we can see everything was on check so no problem. And I lock it again and adjust the, the pressure or the tightness between one and the two. That's okay. This pressure for the one millimeter width wine for the stainless steel all good I will close the, the lid and lock it this is the power and the signal socket of the wine feeder. This is the seven pins socket and here is the checkpoint. The plug is seven pins and the checkpoint is here. We need to connect the plug this way and make sure the check point insert the plug through the check point and lock it I Wi-Fi if the plug was connected firmly this fiber Wider comes th three ones, two twenty was ones. The brown one for the hot wine, and this uh, the neutral one, and um, uh, yellow green is the uh, ground one. We need connect it to the power cabinet with twenty uh, two hundred twenty volt power.
This is the the trailer of fiber wire and this uh, fin tank the input power it's a 16 liter capacity we suggest to fill 14 to 16 liters and it accept the purified water this is water or the the coolant of the car use if the temperature uh, is too low.